वेलकम टू एवरी वन माई सेल्फ आरती पटेल फ्रॉम एल जे इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग एंड टेक्नोलॉजी आई एम एसोसिएटेड विथ एल जे आई टी सिंस टू थाउजेंड सेवन आई विल टीच यू इंजीनियरिंग ग्राफिक्स एंड डिजाइन सब्जेक्ट बेसिकली इट इज द सब्जेक्ट ऑफ मेकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग फील्ड विच इज ऑफर इन all the branches of engineering in the first year now there will be the question in your mind what is engineering graphics and why we are learning this subject engineering graphics is a language of engineers involved in engineering activities without engineering graphics we cannot image high tech world so i want to tell you that it is an abstract and magic in engineering field okay then why it is known as language of engineer because in engineering the product related ideas are recorded by preparing drawings and the execution of work is also carried out on the basis of drawing so in the field of engineering it is used as media of communication that's why it is known as language of engineer now let us discuss an overview of the different topics that we are going to learn in this subject the very first topic is introduction in introduction we will learn application of drawing instruments types of lines like thick line thin line medium line and its application system of dimensioning like a line dimensioning and unidirectional dimensioning types of scale like plane scale and diagonal scale construction of basic geometrical figure like triangle square pentagon hexagon etc next topic is loci of points it is also known as locus of point what is locus of point locus of point is a path trace out by a point which move with given definite conditions the aim of locus of point is to find out locus of point on moving mechanism like slider crank mechanism four bar chain mechanism trunnion mechanism here you can see the example of four bar chain mechanism next topic is engineering curves engineering curves are useful by their nature and characteristics and its knowledge is very important in all the branches of engineering the mainly used curves are conics cycloidal involutes and spiral you can see it is used in construction of bridge design of gear tip and so many other applications are that next topic is projection what is projection the representation of an object on the two dimensional plane is called projection it is very important topic of this subject in projection we will learn projection of points and lines projection of planes like triangle square pentagon hexagon rhombus circle ellipse etc projection of solids like pyramid 
prism, cone and cylinder. Now projection of solid is further divided into two parts. Section of solid and development of surfaces. Section of solid means to take the section of an object by the cutting plane to observe internal parts of the object. Development of surfaces means to unfold or unroll the solid object. It is used where the sheet metal work is required. Next topic is orthographic projection. Orthographic projection means multi-view representation of the given 3D object. Here you can see the front view, top view and side view of the given 3D object. Next topic is isometric projection. Isometric projection means to draw a 3D object from the given orthographic views. Last topic is AutoCAD. If you want to draw all this drawing in computer by using some software, then this drawing or design is known as Computer Aided Design CAD. In this topic, we will learn basic drawing commands and modify commands only. So, these are glimpse of engineering graphics and design subject. We will learn all this topic in details in upcoming lectures. Hope you all enjoyed exploring the journey of engineering graphics and design subject with me. Thank you for watching and goodbye.